Okay, here is my reaction to CitizenCon 2017 gameplay demo. Oh my god! Yeah, I thought it was that good. This is what I have been waiting for. Being able to start the game somewhere, get in your ship, fly around the planet, and through the cities, enjoying the views, then heading up and away from the planet, up into space, all seamlessly, with no load screens to break the immersion. Those jarring load screens that take away from the feeling that you're living in this landscape, this universe. Games have always relied on these load screens. I wasn't sure that they could actually pull this off completely. I mean, I figured they were going to end up having to have load screen going from space to a planet or vice versa. I was wrong. Dead wrong. Unbelievable. I don't care if there's only a few areas in the city that is interactive. I'm not looking to play Grand Theft Auto. I want to get missions or buy some gear at shops and then leave the city. The I idea is to get in your ship and go somewhere, not run around in a virtual city all day. There's other games for that experience, in my opinion. The scale of the game is what I was happy to see them demonstrate also. When they jumped from the space station to Hurston, it took 8 minutes in real time. 23 million kilometers. 23 million. Now imagine doing this in game. Crew members can get up and walk around in the ship, uh, role play, do some repairs maybe. I don't care. This opens up many aspects of the game like getting jump disrupted, like they did in Freelancer, and attacked. You will be so far away from other people that help wouldn't be immediately available, so you would have to survive long enough and either break away, kill your enemy, or have help arrive if you put out a distress beacon. Which, by the way, could possibly bring more pirates instead of help. Imagine the scenarios. Many people were unhappy that there was no gameplay shown. I disagree. They showed tons of gameplay, just not a mission, but not everything in this game will be mission based. There are tens of thousands of backers who are not really interested in battles and the first person shooter aspects. They want to role play. They want to explore and enjoy the experience. That will be their gameplay. It would have been nice to see them do a mission, but that would have made the presentation much, much longer. They will be doing more presentations in the future, and I'm sure they don't want to show too much for fear of if things have to change, then people will just complain more about it. Just look at all the complainers even now after this demo. They still find something to complain about. For me, this demo dispelled any of my fears about them not being able to pull off the scale and the gameplay without load screens. That was really all I didn't think they could do. It remains to be seen if they can pull it off over the network with thousands of people, but I now have a much better sense of the game going forward. That's all for now, citizens. Thank you for watching.